Kidney dialysis is a major problem for COVID-19. Here's why. In our battle against COVID, we've heard about massive shortages in the ICU, such as ventilators that are critical to patients fighting this respiratory virus. But what about dialysis machines? Some doctors on the front lines are now sounding the alarm, saying they have a dire need for these machines. Estimates are that 3 to 9% of COVID-19 patients will develop acute kidney injury. And some doctors have reported that in their experience, it could be twice as many. This leads us to the question, how does coronavirus cause kidney damage in the first place? Well, the truth is we aren't sure yet. The kidneys could be a direct target of the virus or they could be damaged as a result of widespread infection in your body. What we do know is acute kidney injury may need to be treated with dialysis. This life-saving machine takes over the essential functions of your kidneys, giving them a chance to rest and fully recover. Right now, ICUs simply don't have enough of these dialysis machines. Their supplies or nurses trained to operate them for the number of COVID patients with kidney injuries. We need to get ahead of this problem and increase our production and distribution of dialysis equipment. All COVID patients should have access to this potentially life-saving treatment. I'm Dr. Oz. This has been your COVID-19 News Minute.